An unsettling scene outside Little Elm High School on Friday as a long line of parents gather to pick up students during a lockdown. I'm very disappointed. Parents worried with police, ambulances and firefighters rushing to the campus all after a student protest escalated into what the Little Elm Independent School District is describing as a disturbance. Just confused and a little upset. That disturbance, some students say so chaotic, video circulating on social media shows police deploying a spray and using tasers on students. To see it on camera, it was horrible. Students say complaints about an alleged sexual assault, which some felt administrators were ignoring, triggered the on-campus protest. In a statement, the school district says some students began behaving in a way that caused a major disruption. But they started banging on the, on the windows and like doors for them to come out. It just started getting a little bit rowdy. The school district says four students were arrested, accused of assaulting little Elm police officers, but parents want more clarity and answers. The school's supposed to keep the kids safe, but they should not be shot with rubber bullets. While police aren't yet confirming details about use of force, parents say they're expecting some solid answers and explanations in the coming days. In Little Elm, I'm Damon Fernandez.